This Jugback Rocky Mountain Classic gave many wrestlers a chance to prove their place against some of the best competition of the season. Our Athletes of the Week remain too tough to beat. KPAX's Jack Ginsburg introduces a pair of perfect Bronx. On Saturday, two Frenchtown Bronx ended up atop the podium in their respective weight classes. In the 113 class, Walker Dyer won by way of major decision, beating his opponent 14 to 2. And over in the 120 class, two-time state defending champion Jake Bibler won a decision 6 to 2. Although the numbers show otherwise, both wrestlers say the matches were a challenge. Um, so well, uh, I didn't really know the kid going into it. Didn't know what he was going to do, so a game plan was just go out and wrestle. Just do what I do. It was a pretty tough match. I had to wrestle him pretty smart because he's obviously pretty good. He was a two-timer and so was I, so yeah, I just had to be smart with my moves. However, don't let that fool you. Both Bibbler and Dyer may not talk much, but they don't mince words when it comes to their confidence on the mat. I mean, I've pinned everybody before that kid, so it's been a pretty good tournament. And going into that, it was a little bit hard going into the third and not pinning him, but I still stayed on top. It was good. It makes me feel pretty good about state. I think I should do pretty good. Plan on winning it. So. However, their coach says it's a confidence that has been formed from the work they put in day in and day out, and it's deserved. For Walker to make the jump that he has in the last year, it's been really impressive. And a lot of it has to do with his work ethic and his desire to be in the room. If that door is open, he's in here. Um, if we go to a tournament, it doesn't matter what's going on, he's there. Jake's probably, as long as I've ever coached, the most consistent wrestler I've ever coached. He just did the same thing he does every time. He goes out and he competes and he sticks to his game plan and he wrestles tough. And their goals for the rest of the season? They're just as clear and confident. Um, I just plan on keep winning, stay undefeated all year. In Missoula, Jack Ginsburg, MTN Sports. Both Dyer and Bibler remained undefeated on the season with those wins on Saturday. The state tournament is now only three weeks away.